Hello, this is Solar PVTV from SolarX Istanbul 2016. We are together with uh, Michael Belmer, Managing Director of uh, LTI RE Energy, and we are in sunny Istanbul. And how was the year 2015 for your company? Was it also so sunny like uh, the weather here in Istanbul? Tomasz, uh, thanks uh, for the question. Yeah, it was a very good year. Uh, we actually, as Gerber, took over LTI RE Energy some two and a half years back. So, and uh, the things are developing very nicely. Both companies, the roots of LTI, the technology provider, and uh, Kerber Group in the background works very, very nicely together. So we are very pleased uh, with the last year. So I remember that uh, last year you were mentioning that you are developing this concept of uh, uh, German heart and local content, developing uh, partnerships in different regions, different regions, uh, different countries. So uh, which are the most uh, promising and most successful markets for you? Yeah, we finished uh, the localization in the US um, with our partner Scholz over there. This is known, I guess. Um, we picked up also new countries like uh, India and China, and especially India we are very excited about. I mean, you know, it's uh, one of the fastest growing market, very tight um, market, of course, on the one hand side, but uh, it's very good for us as a company to be there present. We have a good partner. We also touch ground on uh, Brazil. Brazil, actually, we are using a sister company of ours within the Kerber uh, portfolio. This is developing nice. Uh, we have there a partner who's uh, been signing uh, private PPAs. Uh, so this is giving a lot of stability uh, for the business. And uh, last but not least, of course, uh, talking about Turkey and being in Turkey, uh, we have there our partners who are helping us uh, to get uh, yeah, as much possible local content, German hard local content, uh, you named it. So and we realized, um, yeah, the first um, projects, um, a couple of uh, 10 megawatts um, here and there. So we are quite happy about this and looking in a very good year, 2016, also in Turkey. So Michael, uh, you are focused especially on the large scale projects uh, and solutions. So uh, you are dealing, let's say, on a daily basis with uh, projects developers, investors. And uh, what are the issues uh, on all these uh, emerging markets that you would say? I mean, I think uh, the biggest issue, and uh, many people uh, will agree uh, with me, is sometimes, of course, um, that there is not uh, a clear guidance uh, from the governments how exactly uh, what is needed. Um, the grid companies, of course, uh, are playing an important uh, role. And we are picking this up, so we are very much with our developers uh, are going together uh, to the grid companies, uh, finding out about the grid codes. Um, taking advice also and giving advice basically to really do big installments in new regions. I mean, what you are referring to is definitely John, it's definitely Egypt and yeah, I see the things very, very, very positive and I think uh, both markets have good potential and I'm also one of the guys who are believing uh, in these markets that a lot of big projects will be realized. What about uh, financing questions, uh, bankability questions? Uh, because uh, what we are hearing that uh, I think it becomes one of the major issues now. So there is a lot of projects on the market, but uh, there is still a um, problem to attract the financing and also the bankability of the products. Yeah, I mean, uh, the whole market is getting uh, much more professional from year to year, this is clear. Um, so we, uh, as a big company group behind uh, Love It, uh, Kerber is a 2.5 billion euro company in private hands by trust structure. So uh, we see a lot of um, professional parties um, getting the project right they need and then the financial closing is also, I think, very doable. Um, we had uh, definitely the situation that some parts of the market, perhaps not uh, very experienced people were uh, trying to do it and they were not achieving uh, financial closing and this is of course uh, blocking some markets. Yeah? And this is uh, difficult. But um, when we're talking about uh, especially new regions and new markets like Egypt, I think they are very professional players um, active in project development and uh, relying on good component suppliers on the module side for sure and on the inverter side uh, we are definitely one of those who is giving then also financial stability into the projects and help developing partners and investors for doing financial closing. So you are also supporting them yes, uh, in all this process? Yeah, supporting is um, always a matter what uh, to define with supporting on this one. What is sure is uh, that the technical risks are being evaluated by professional parties and you want to ensure for an inverter that this company is on the market in 20 or 25 years. And uh, that's perhaps not the case uh, for all suppliers in the market. So we very much believe uh, this is a differentiating edge. And it's very important for financial closing to have the right components being designed in. 
So what is your recipe, let's say, for continuing to be successful uh, still in 2016 and also afterwards? I think it's really the two elements you're saying. The one is uh, the local content strategy we are doing for political reasons, for sure. Creating a workforce in those countries is a big, big thing. And I think uh, we discussed it in another occasion. I find it also very democratic yeah, to say uh, not only solar is occurring, but um, people uh, can participate in their regions. So that's what we are supporting with our local content strategy. And the second thing is uh, that we see strategic alliances in a way that developer and investor groups are working together on fixed designs. And so we are moving in the one or in the other country uh, together as a team. And I think this is really good for the world market because the things are quicker to be realized and grid connected. And that's at the end of the day what we all want. Exactly. So you think that uh, you will have a lot of uh, Gunish in your business this year? Yeah, we, we are looking uh, very optimistic about it. We also have the wind business, which is uh, tremendously developing. It's, it's exciting to be in this market as well. We do the, the pitch systems. So, and uh, for the solar, it's the same. So I'm excited about 2016 and the opportunities. Okay, thank you so much, Michael. And uh, we will speak another time, maybe at InterSolar Europe. Thank you so much. Thank you, Tomasz. Thank you. And uh, Tese Kuler. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, thank you so much, Michael. That was Solar PV TV together with Michael Belmer from LTI Ari Energy. Mm -hmm.